Welcome to the channel. This is a follow-up to my installation guide on how to set up a deeper miner. I got some DMs and comments about not knowing how to buy the deeper that you need to stake. And I didn't include it in the video because you can buy it from several different locations and it would extend the length of the video. But it seems like it's important, so I made a separate video just for that. So there's a few different places that you can buy it. That includes Gate.io, KuCoin, Mexi, Flybit, Hotbit, you can also swap for it on PancakeSwap and Uniswap. In this video, I'm gonna be using KuCoin because I use it a lot and I trust it, but you should use whatever exchange you're comfortable with. So let's take a look. So we're just gonna open up our browser and we're gonna search for KuCoin. And KuCoin.com is the official URL. That's the one that we're gonna to go to. So we're gonna click on that. And here we are at the homepage. If you don't have an account, what you're gonna to wanna to do is click on the sign up link over here and it's gonna ask you for your phone or email address. What you wanna do is enter all this information in, look at the terms of use and then click on sign up. Once you've signed up for an account, what you wanna do is click on the deposit section over here. And what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be buying USDT. USDT is gonna be the crypto that we're using in the exchange to buy DPR. Once you've purchased your USDT, it's gonna show up here in your main account. Now we need to transfer it from our main account into our trading account so we can buy DPR. So you go ahead and you transfer it over. And once you do that, it's gonna show up here as a balance. Now that it's in our trading account, we can go over to the trade and spot training to buy our DPR. Now it's gonna load up the trading tool. Inside the trading tool, you wanna to search for the pair USDT DPR. We're just typing in DPR up here at the top and you can see the pair, which is DPR slash USDT. That's the one we wanna select. And this is the one that we're gonna be buying. If you set up a trading password, you're gonna to wanna to enter that in right now. There is a few options that you can use to buy DPR. You can use the limit where you set the price that you wanna buy it at. You can use the market price and you can use the stop limit. And what we're gonna be doing in this example is buying DPR at the market price. It's the easiest way to do it. And when we do this, we just enter in the amount of USDT that we wanna spend and then we click on buy. And what it's gonna do is it's gonna buy as much DPR it can get for that. In this example, I'm buying a thousand. You can see that my order has been completed. It shows how much USDT I spent and it also lets me know the price that I bought my DPR at. So now that we made our purchase, you can click on the KuCoin icon up here. So here's our main account and we're just gonna go over to our trading account. Everything that we've just purchased is still in our trading account. You can see my balance right now. It's right over here. And what we need to do in order to send it to our MetaMask wallet is we need to move it out of our trading account into our main account. So we're gonna click on this transfer link over here on the left-hand side. So we have the two accounts selected right over here. I can move the maximum amount, click on continue, and it's gonna confirm it into my main account. There are no fees when you're transferring it internally from account to account, so you don't have to worry about that. Now that we have it over here in our main account, we can just move it out into our MetaMask wallet. In order for us to do that, we wanna click on the withdraw option. Before we continue, you have to make sure that you have MetaMask installed like I do over here and that you're connected to the Binance Smart Chain mainnet. Now, if you're not connected to the Binance Smart Chain mainnet, you can check out this video and I'll walk you through the settings. After that, we wanna have the DPR or Deeper Networks token added. To import the token, there's a link at the bottom that says import tokens. You can just select that. And inside here, what we need to provide is a contract address. So I'm inside CoinMarketCap. I've searched for Deeper Networks. So it comes up over here. And down here, we have the Ethereum contract and we also have the BSC contract. So we wanna click on the copy option. I already have it in, that's why it says that's already in here, uh, but it'll automatically populate the symbol and the token. So we have it in there and then you can scroll down and it should show up like this. Now we can just switch back over to our KuCoin account. I'm gonna open up my MetaMask wallet and I'm gonna ensure that I'm on the Binance Smart Chain. I'm gonna copy my wallet address. Now in here under withdraw, we have the option to paste in our wallet address. So I'll just paste that in here. And below we have the network option. So we have the BSC and we have the Ethereum. You wanna make sure that we select the BSC. So if you try actually selecting the Ethereum, you can see that the fees are 200 DPR. And we switch back over to BSC and you can see that the DPR is only 20. So there's a significant difference between the two. That's why we're using BSC and that's why Deeper Networks is also suggesting to use BSC as a primary way of transferring funds. So I'm gonna select the maximum amount here and I have no remarks. You don't you can leave that field empty. You can click on confirm. And what that's gonna do is now transfer it out of your KuCoin account into your MetaMask wallet. There are a few confirmation steps that you're gonna to wanna to do before you withdraw. It's gonna ask you for your password, your 2FA, and your trading information. This is completely normal. It's very secure. That's why I like using KuCoin. So you have to provide all these details and then it'll withdraw it from your account and then it'll send it to your MetaMask wallet and that's it. That's how you buy DPR using KuCoin and send it to your MetaMask wallet. 
I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please smash that like button. Like I mentioned at the beginning of the video, this is not the only way to buy DPR and send it to your MetaMask wallet. There are other exchanges and I'll make sure I link all those in the description below. So if you have any questions, go ahead and put them in the comments below. I'll do my best to answer them. Thank you for watching and I'll catch you on the next one.